I think a lot of young men have a lot of questions and maybe uh, even some misconceptions about what seminary is really like. Uh, while at, uh, to one degree it's very normal and similar to uh, maybe your, what you'd expect of a college experience, it's also very different all at the same time. And so hopefully I can explain a little bit for you some of the ways that it's uh, similar and some of the ways that it's different. Regarding similarities, uh, seminary is, you know, we go to school, we have regular academic classes, uh, just like you would in a normal college, and uh, you're there with young men of your own, uh, who are your age as well, who are in the same boat as you, and have the same, same purpose of discerning a priestly vocation. And some of the differences of how it might be different and what you're expecting of maybe a regular college experience. Uh, we come together every day to pray together. Uh, there's a lot less, uh, maybe what you'd first consider freedoms that you might have in a regular college. For example, you know, you may not be allowed to go into town on, a, say, a Tuesday afternoon uh, to watch a movie that you might want to go see. Uh, while this might seem burdensome or even oppressive, when you first come to seminary in time, you come to realize how that is a freeing thing uh, to have those, those sort of restrictions in place allows you to be fully present to your work as a seminarian, your work in, in formation, in, in learning, and in coming to know yourself, and also in discernment, and asking whether or not God is in fact calling you to be a priest. I think some guys think that... Uh, that seminarians are really holy people, and that they all they do is pray all the time, and and if that that's something that, that you think is the case, uh, I think that you'll soon find out that, that really hey, that isn't quite the case. There are a lot of a lot of men who are very good and, and humble and holy individuals. Yet the fact that uh, you you may think that you know we sit in the chapel all day long that that isn't the that isn't the case. We do very normal things just like. Uh, any other young men, you know, we enjoy each other's company and we'll go to town uh, when we're allowed to on the weekends to, you know, watch a movie or maybe go to dinner or just to hang out and enjoy each other's company. Uh, it's a very normal and very healthy thing. It's necessary for seminary. I think a lot of guys, too, think that uh, if you make a mistake, it's the end of the world. Uh, if you get in trouble, it's the end of the world. You'll soon find out that... Uh, Making a mistake, maybe getting in trouble, is uh, just a normal part of seminary. And you know, if somebody calls you out for something that you've done, or you do get in trouble, it's not the end of the world. And you'll learn from that mistake. And mistakes are a good thing, and at times even a very necessary uh, part of seminary. So don't be afraid uh, of making a mistake or getting in trouble. Uh, it's not something to be afraid of. So hopefully, this little clip has uh, maybe cleared up maybe a few you know, misconceptions or misunderstandings that you might have had about seminary life. Uh, and hopefully it'll uh, help you if you are, are considering seminary. So thank you.